Clients need to see different approaches to their projects before deciding on a final design. Can you blame them? Lumion addresses this with variations, which makes it easy to switch between different designs in build mode and in your rendered presentations. It's quite easy to create a variation of your model. Let me show you how it's done. To kick things off, let's open up this interior project. It's already a really appealing design, but the client wants to see some more life in it. First, let's take a look at the wall and see how we can make it pop out more. So I'm gonna add a bit of color to it. Okay, this looks great, but what if we wanna show even more variations of it? Let's load a new variation of our model by selecting it and picking the Add Variation button. Lumion 12 will create an exact duplicate of it. Then make sure that the new variation is selected on the screen and go to the Material Editor. Select the material and let's use a different color map. Nice. Now you can easily switch between variations to make up your mind on the wall design. The same principles can be applied to geometry. We can go back to the Kaufman House example project and play with it a bit. Let's load a few different geometries for it. Two should be enough. We know that adding a variation will only create an exact duplicate of the model. So you need to select that and replace it with the variation file by clicking on the reimport button while holding the Alt key. This way, you can showcase different variations of your models with the click of a button and make on-the-fly design decisions together with the stakeholders in your project. Now, what if you want to switch to different iterations of a model in a photo or video? No problem. Luckily, Lumion has the versatile variation control effect to help you do just that. Let me show you what I mean. In this project, we have three variations of the wall in this living room. To show a different variation before rendering the photo for your client, all you have to do is add the variation control effect. Then select the model and adjust the current variation slider to the variation number you want to display. We have three images, so let's set one variation per image. Sometimes the changes are more architecture oriented, and when that happens, you may have to try different approaches to modeling the building itself. The changes you can make are not only static in Lumion. Movie mode gives you the possibility to change the variations in the middle of a clip. In the Kaufman House example scene, we have a couple of models that each have a minimum of one variation. Selecting the summer kitchen and adding the variation control effect will allow us to create a keyframe in our clip that switches instantly from one design to the other during the animation. Remember that you can do this for multiple models in the same clip by stacking the variation control effect for each model. The same can be done with the Kaufman house in a couple of keyframes. Let's play it. Now the only problem is Lumion makes all the choices look good. So be ready to offer some guidance to your clients. Hey, if you like this video, hit that like and subscribe button, ring the bell, and then follow me over to this tutorial about importing your models into Lumion, which is the first step to creating variations. I'll see you in there.